Hi everyone, welcome again. Today we will see one issue or error or I would say we will see topic how to use T code MMAM or it is also an issue where uh, how we can change material type after its goods receipt or invoice receipt in SAP MM. Uh, before that, if you are new on my channel, please subscribe my channel and also share this issue or real time issue with your friends or colleagues that might help them. So here we will see how to change material type after its goods received or invoice received through the MMAMT code. Also note that in this scenario, you might have your stock exist. So how to manage that stock and how to use MMAM. So we'll see in detail. Uh, we will create one material, we will create one example, we will have stock and how we will manage that stock. So this is the problem statement where for let's say ABC or some any material customer have done goods receipt and invoice receipt and then customer realize that material type for this particular material is not right. So it might be anything here. I have taken example of ROH. or FERT that is your finished product or ROH that is your raw material. So you might have noticed that it's wrongly created different material type, but you have done POGRIR and now you have realized. So how we can change this material type using T code MMAM. So we'll see this. Also now that what I said, like customer don't want to reverse the documents, but still they want to change the material type for this particular material and uh, they have stock exist in their inventory. So let's see how we can do it. So I will go into the system and uh, I will create a scenario. So first I will create one material and I will do goods receipt and invoice receipt. Let's say I'm creating material ROH. So I, I will just use basic views that is uh, basic data purchasing plant and storage location one and accounting view that are the mostly needed for this scenario so i will cover those only so let's see i'm creating material so it's a test material for material type change then you can create you know how to create material using only the required views here so i will use only required views in purchasing data i am just creating required views here no all data required so in plant storage no required here it is important so as i have selected roh i will select standard 300 as an valuation class then standard price let's say 10 eur per one unit and it's moving average price okay i will create this material so this material is created I will just take a note of this material for our reference. So we will have this material. Okay. Then what I will do, I will create purchase order for this material using ME21N. I will use any old vendor that I have created might be some time back in the system and all the standard or SAP predefined company code plant and rest data. Here I will use material this. So my material is two, three, Six two three three. Okay, two three six two three three six two three three. Okay, then let's say quantity hundred unit of measure delivery date anything in future. Then net price let's say ten EUR. It's plant and storage location yeah that's all i guess that's the all i i need yeah everything is fine no issue at all i will check the purchase order if it is clear 
okay no issue then i will save this purchase order okay i will take its number for my reference so this is purchase order now i will do a goods received for this purchase order in Migo. Obviously, moment type 101 and goods receipt for against purchase order. Okay, quantity 100 as it is. I'm not changing anything. Item is okay. Where? Yeah, everything is mentioned. This is the purchase order. This is the vendor. No account assignment. Okay, I will check. Okay, everything is fine. So let's save it. It's warning. So I ignored that. Okay, this is the goods receipt has been done against this purchase order. Okay, then I will, you might do invoice or you might skip it. But for just example, I'm doing invoice here. Okay, I will take purchase order number. I have given reference of goods received here. So this is the my purchase order. Then calculate tax. Okay, any baseline date required? Yes, because that will be the error, but yeah. Now this will go here in amount, or not, not this, in basic data this will be the amount and it's green so seems everything is fine i can simulate or i can save directly okay i have saved this now i will go into the purchase order and i will check the purchase order history in me23n yeah so this is the purchase order and i have done goods receipt and goods invoice in another tab i will check stock as well for this particular material in mmbe this is the material i am not providing plant storage location or anything like that i am just checking stock for this material in entire system so yeah 100 is there in this plant against this sorry in this plant against this storage location and this is the company so 100 is the stock now how i can change material type so i know there is a t code mm am to change the material type this is the t code where we can change material type so this is the material and let's say what will be my new material type so it will be ferT as per my example i will recheck in example Yeah, so material is minted with ROH, ROH, but I need its FART that is the finished product instead of raw material. So let's go into system and here I have select finished product. So system took its old material type automatically. So let's say I want to change it. So I will execute. System give one warning that there is a still open purchase order and items. It's just warning, so we can skip and we can proceed ahead. But then you will face this error that system will not allow you to do so because system find that there is a valuated stock exist that we already saw in MMBE. So how we can change material type? So this is the complete problem statement and system is not allowing us to change the material type. So now how we can change? So we will settle this stock against some movement type or so this is the known error then how we can solve this issue. So we can do in a two way one is we can settle or remove this stock using movement type 562. So let's say we have removed that stock. So we can go into Migo and here we can, sorry, here we can go into the goods issue here, other, and here we can select 562 movement type.
so it will remove your initial stock so what is my material so i will copy that material okay let's say 100 quantity from fair so moment type is 562 from which plant i want to remove its triple zero one and its storage location is also the same uh, no need of partner and let's see if it's allowing yeah there is no issue so we can proceed further and i can save this document yeah document is posted now i will go into mmb and let's check stock if it is zero now yes it is absolutely zero no stock anywhere against this material now i will go again and i will change this mmm uh, one more thing you can change this not only with 562 but you can assign this stock uh, to any other uh, cost center as well for example you can assign against 201 moment type so you can assign this stock against cost center so you can do that as well so for a while assign this stock anywhere you can assign to project as well so it should not be under the inventory it should be assigned somewhere else change material type and bring it back to uh, your original stock so just do reversal of movement but i use 562 but you have alternative you can use cost center project or whatever suits you okay now i will go back in mmam and now i will try to change material type so we will see at table level as well material type for this material so i will run sc 16 n this is the table to check material type that is a mara here i will get all basic data of material so yeah moment type is here roh that is a raw sorry not moment type it's a material type is roh so now we are interested to change this to FERT. So go into this MMAM T code, give your material, what material type you want in future and system will pick old material type, then execute. System will give warning what valuation class you need. So you can select all out of these valuation class. So I will go with nine, 7920 and that's it so now we are changing from roh that is our class was 3000 and we are giving new material class valuation class so material type will be fart but again we can select different valuation class as well if that material have different valuation classes in same material type so i am using 7920 that is a standard and i will go ahead so now material type has been changed you can see here so material type is changed now let's see if it's changed really at table level so i will i'm already in this screen so we are interested in this so i will just refresh this table and see so now material type has been changed to fart now next action is pending so what we need to do the stock that we have moved now we have zero stock but at actual we have 100 and for temporary we have removed that stock so now i will go again in miro and i will do the reversal of that particular movement sorry not in miro but migo and i will do the reversal of movement so i'm running t code migo so instead of now 561 i will 562 i will do 561 so again the same material the quantity is 100 then plant and storage location everything seems fine no partner required no account assignment okay just check and post so I'm posting directly so this has been done now again I will go in MMB and I will check stock so 100 quantity will be there with new material types so this is the way we can change material type because 
to changing material type there is a prerequisite we should have zero stock in inventory if it is a valuated material we should have zero stock and we cannot change material type directly so th this is the known error in this mmam so th we will see summary what we have seen so we checked if for particular abc material we have zero stock in mmbe then if no zero stock then settle that stock to zero with this movement or you can use either 221 or any other movement for temporary you can give this stock against particular movement type or particular cost center project or wbs whatever suits you then check stock if it's really moved then go into mmam and change material type and reverse the movement whatever you used here in my case i used this two movement type that is uh, 201 and 502 but you can use other as well and then do reversal of those movement type with migo itself and again check stock if it is change so this is the way we can change the material stock uh, sorry material type so thank you for watching this video in case you have question on this please put in comment section and i will try to revert you back so thanks for watching this video share with your friends it's the example of real time issues uh, that might be faced during your day to day activities sometimes business create materials with the wrong material types and now they wanted to change it it's very simple but many people don't know how to do it so thanks for watching see you in the next video bye